everyone welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel my name is miss tamika i upload videos once a week which is sunday at four and then i also throw in a bonus video throughout the week that being said y'all you know your girl been shopping honey <laughs> but your girl been shopping and of course i wanted to share so if you want to see what i got here in this bag stay tuned and keep watching. So, I've been shopping at the outlets lately. And the reason why, because I've been getting some good deals, you guys. Like, oh my gosh, I've been sleeping on the outlets. It is a ride. It's about an hour and 30 minutes from here, but it's worth it in my opinion. And especially if you love makeup like I do and love a good deal, then you may want to check out your uh, outlet stores I'm in a different location. So you will hear a little bit of noise in the background. So hopefully it doesn't bother you guys. And from Coach, Ulta, and the Cosmetic um, Company, I think it's the Cosmetic Company store. I've been sleeping on that store like oh my gosh you guys I hit the time for jackpot start off with coach first I purchased a to me from me type of gift this is my Mother's Day gift to myself I don't know I've been liking coach lately like I said coach was one of my first loves way back when so I was in the coach outlet because you know coach Michael Kors and Kate Spade is all out there in there I saw the backpack bag and I was like okay the bag was so nice it was like it was four hundred and something dollars and with the sale it was 190 and then you had additional 15 percent off but i was like no tamika you just purchased a coach backpack so no maybe you know if i wait a little longer it may go down even cheaper not that that price wasn't a good price but like i said i just spent a few dollars here on this coach bag so i wasn't looking for a bag, but I did see a lot of cute little bags, and then I saw, and then I also saw a lot of cute little pink accessories. So I was like, but that's not why I came in the coach. I actually came to go to the cosmetic store, but I'm always walking and looking. So I was like, okay. So I came across this. This was a really, really good deal because the uh, the actual price was seventy dollars, you guys. And let me tell you how much I paid for it: seventeen fifty before tax and with tax it came to 18.55 was blown away because when i asked the man i said how much is this case he told me 20 dollars and some change and i was like okay that's still a good deal but when i purchased the case it rung up 17.50 and i was like oh my gosh just like yes so i got this case and it came in this nice box on the back of the case it has like slots for you to put cards never purchase a case like that where you can put cards at but Right here, it's like really tight so your cards won't fall out. Grab a few cards and my cell phone so I can actually put it all together so you guys can see. My Starbucks rewards card, so I'm gonna just go ahead and slide this right here. So here, as you can see, it fits right here at the top. At my iPhone, my iPhone, which is the 10. Still have my 10, I didn't upgrade yet. I was looking to probably upgrade to the 11 if that comes out i i didn't i was going to upgrade to the 10 like if i would have kept my 7 plus and then the 10 what was it the 10 plus came out i probably would have got the 10 plus but at the time when i upgraded to the 10 they didn't have the plus so i was like okay whatever because you know ooh. okay you guys this is a fail this is for the 10 plus you know why how did i miss that Oh my goodness it doesn't say on the box or anything i thought it was for my case but it's not it's for the 10 plus but i still wanted to show you guys because it is a really cute case for a good price to have to go and figure something out because it doesn't even say on the box it doesn't even say I because this is how it came in a box I should have tried it on in the store it came like this so I was just assuming that it was for the 10 I didn't know it was for the 10 plus I guess it doesn't even look like it's that big yeah so this is a fail but I just wanted to show you guys because this is real life I'm going to have to return this really 
liked it, this case. But here is nowhere on this case, on this box, to actually say which phone this is for. That's what threw me off. Like, I didn't think it would have been a 10 plus because it doesn't say 10 plus. It doesn't even say 10x, but I just saw the cutout for the camera. So that's why I assumed it was for my phone. That was a bummer, you guys. I am upset because that case is cute. And I do not want to ride all the way back down all the way back to Woodstock because that was a far ride like a really far ride we do have one here uh what is it Locust Grove so I may have to call the Locust Grove location to see if I can switch it out there moving on to my next item this is from Ulta and they had a coupon going on this weekend where if you spend 10 you get five dollars off the BH color festival brushes and these are this um bright lime green brushes because of the packaging but after watching some videos and everything i don't think i'm gonna keep the brushes because they are entirely too soft and flimsy like they mm -mm. and i purchased them because i was like okay i was trying to hurry up because i got these when i was at all the way out woodstock like, okay if i purchase them you know i can try them and then if i don't like them I don't even want to try them because I don't even feel like washing the brushes and doing all that before I return them because I don't want to return, you know, dirty brushes. So after watching some reviews on these, I am going to return them because like I said, they are too soft and I need something that's a little more stiff and got a little more firmness to it. For a set, I just wish they weren't as soft because you know, when you apply makeup, you don't need nothing soft and flimsy. You need something that's, you know, stern and you know, strong when you're applying your uh, your uh, makeup. See, like here, this is supposed to be a blush brush, and this is too flimsy. Like, and the price wasn't that expensive. It was twenty seven dollars for this complete set. I said I don't want to keep this if the brushes are not going to work for me, but I did still want to share because just in case you want to check them out, because I don't know, maybe you can make them work. I don't know. I don't know, I'ma still make sure, but yeah, see they too flimsy for me. And like I said, I was just trying to hurry up and use that coupon really quick. I wish they were like more on the Morphe side of, like on the Morphe side of brushes, Morphe brushes, you know, but they didn't have nothing cute like this. I just actually liked it because of the color and the um, little case that it comes in because the actual price for this was 27 and like i said i was able to save five dollars then just wanted to share it just in case you wanted to check it out for yourself because again i could be wrong I may go and look at a few more tutorials just to make sure because my location my also always my also never have like all the new stuff that come out so i was like okay if i purchase these here at this Ulta, I can always take it back to my local Ulta, which is in McDonough. I'm going to share that really quick. And my daughter lip gloss, but of course she has that with her. So on to the best part. I had to save the best for last, you guys. Your girl is addicted. I am addicted to this container. I mean, I keep wanting to say container store, the cosmetic store. On to that cosmetic store, it lets me know that I'm going to slow up with buying regular price makeup items. Because if you go to that uh, cosmetic store, they have Mac, Smashbox, Bobby Brown. Uh, they have Town Four. They have um, I can't. They have Clinique. They have a lot of name brand items at a cheaper price. I don't have nothing against the other makeup stores, but it's like, okay, I'm spending full price on a lot of these things in here at this makeup store. If you wait, you know, a little while, it eventually hit the makeup store. I went to the one in Woodstock. Now the one in Woodstock, Georgia has more time for, but the one that was in, uh, what was that? Forsyth County, I think. That one had a better deal. They do a haul on those things and a lot of, my foundations I got for under $10. And when I tell you they are name brand foundations, like name brand where they are still full price if you go on any other websites. I'm not going to give it up because I want y'all to go and check out that uh, haul. I do uh, upload that haul before this video. I'll leave it up in the card so y'all can go check it out. Go ahead and jump into it. They had so much time for it, you guys. I was just like, oh my goodness. And 
I was so excited because when I went to the one in Forsyth County, I purchased some Tom Ford and had a lot of lip products and only on one Tom Ford lipstick, which is not a really good color. So I don't even know why I picked that color, but yeah, so I did purchase a lip and eye color quad. I got an eyeshadow quad from Tom Ford. Here retail for, I want to say 89 to $90. Of course, you're not in pay for that. Things retail for about 50. Your girl paid for the eyeshadow quad. It was the original price was $66. I paid $39.60. I'm saying like this here is like $80 to $90 at the at your local stores at this uh cosmetic store i only paid 39.60 because it was 40 percent off i was so blown away because i'm like oh my gosh like i wanted to purchase a lot of time four but time four is on the higher end side like time four is a treat for me like i usually buy time four if i have a gift card or if it's a sale or something like i don't really like to pay full price for any time four i think when i purchased that lipstick i was I had like a gift card at the time or something. Bloomingdale's and Nordstrom's, like if you spend a certain amount, they will normally give you a gift card. So I'm not sure how I purchased that first time for it. But all I know is I will never purchase full price for no more time for it ever when you can go to the cosmetic store. It's a ride, but it's worth it if you don't want to spend the original price. Here is the shadow. Already open it. It comes in the, uh, let me put everything back. It comes in the Tom Ford velvet packaging. It's like this brown color that has Tom Ford here across. It's in the color 12 Seductive Rose. They did have a few other quads, but I only had the funds to get just one in a lipstick. Going back. So here is the beautiful packaging. I just love this brown with the gold and you have Tom Ford here. Oh my goodness. So it comes with these two brushes. The brushes are really, really cute. I don't think I will ever use them, but I will keep them here in the shadow quad. So it comes with this clear cover. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at that. Look at that, look how pretty that is. I don't wanna swatch it because I just don't. It's just too pretty. But look how pretty that is. And these are like my type of colors. Like I said, I brought safe colors, you know, where I know I'll use. Of course, I would have to use a transition color from one of my other palettes, but that's fine. A time for eyeshadow palette under under um $50. I mean, you can't beat that. They had other colors, but I just you know wanted to stick to the colors that i'm used to that's why i got the i got this palette for this pink should have checked my iphone case because before i left the uh cosmetic store i wanted to make sure my shadows were in place because i didn't want to go all the way home open it and my shadows were you know shattered or messed up i don't know why i didn't check that case and the mirror on here is nice you guys it's a really nice size and it and it's like really you can actually do a shadow you can actually do your eye makeup using this um mirror so impressed with time forward stuff is really nice but in my opinion i wouldn't pay full price not saying it's not worth it but again how many times you think i'm gonna use this you know to spend full price for any makeup that i have a shopping problem when it comes to makeup like i'm addicted to makeup like like a crackhead like i have to have makeup and i'm trying to cut back on a lot of stuff buying a lot of stuff but sometimes it's just so hard because i don't even use half of the stuff that i do have, especially the lip products i just have a lot of stuff so i'm grateful i have a daughter that i can share a lot of this stuff with but i'm trying to wait till she's old enough to actually take care of the stuff because i gives her I gives her a lot of stuff, but she really doesn't take care of it as of yet. You know, I spend a lot of money on my makeup, but I'm going to try. I'm going to try and slow down. Now, since I found this cosmetic store, it's going to be really, really hard. Anyway, my next item is the Tom Ford Lip Shine, and this is in the color 07 Noble. Noble. And, of course, you know Tom Ford packaging is really cute. Now, I have the the fatter lipstick i doesn't i don't have the smaller version of this 
and this color here like I said when I purchase something uh, new I like to get a safe color I will swatch this this here is the color right here on my hand and it's more like a pinky nude I'm sure I can make this work I had to get a lipstick from this particular line I do have a lot of other things that I want to purchase so once I start, you know, saving up my money or whatever the case is, I probably will go back and get some more time for. Now I will treat myself to some time for it because this price is just unbelievable, you guys. Hair lipstick at the outlet store. I don't know that, like I said, that the retail price for these on the regular website, I want to say it's $50. At the cosmetic store, it was $41. So your girl only paid $24.75. So the retail purchase at a time for lipsticks, you can actually purchase two at the cosmetic store. Believe it, and I'm sure the YSL is probably going to be a lot cheaper than Town 4 because you know Town 4 is already high as it is. And then they had a sale where if you spend over 100, you get 50% off, but Town 4 wasn't included. Town 4, you only get 40, but I was fine with that because 40 is a big deal, you know, a nice discount off of the discounted already priced at the cosmetic store it's actually called the cosmetic company store i wish they had a website because you know i would be online shopping for days because like i said it's not around the corner for me yeah you guys that was everything that i got like i said this haul was going to be really really fast because i just wanted to share that i have just in case you have a cosmetic company store uh, you know in your area or close by you may want to go check it out it, I did do a uh, makeup tutorial on this look so if you want to check that out I'll probably leave it somewhere up in the cards as well. If you like these types of videos give this video a big thumbs up because it helps out my channel and also don't forget to click on that subscribe button and that notification bell so y'all can be notified each week when your girl uploads videos and until next time I will talk to you later. Bye.